Hi, welcome to the re-recording of this video. I know why I re-recorded because I was in the Taylor Swift's label Big Machine because I was standing and the discomfort in my face was appearing. So now I'm sitting behind me. You can tell is the shelf of knowledge. Uh, I'm in my brother's room, so done. Today we're gonna talk about something that I really like: music. I don't know about you guys, but I usually base my whole love for music on Anthony Fontano. Damn, boy, he thick, boy. That's a thick ass boy. Damn, ba -ba! Um, <laughs> I mean, it's silly to say, but sometimes I watch Anthony Anthony Fontano. Not gonna lie, to discover some artists, some good music, and I'm on the website called Album of the Year. Which is like a good website also to rate music that you listen to and also discover music from the same genre too. I know, what are you gonna say? What does this have to do with anything? I know. So, I was thinking, I was talking to myself so I can like prepare myself to talk in videos without cutting or whatsoever and try to be more professional. I was like, hmm, what if I had an album and what would be the sound of it? And since I liked photography a lot, I was like, hmm, why, why, why should I not call it motion blur? So motion blur is basically when you put your shutter speed in the lowest, like 1 over 60, 1 over 30 seconds. Like now, for example, it's on 1 over 250 seconds. I mean, when I do this, it's very smooth. Hi, how are you? For example, when I turn on the shutter speed on 1 30th of a second, it becomes hella slow. Let me just change the setup. I don't know if you can witness this, but it's kind of blurry. Ooh. I don't know if you can tell the difference, but now it's on 1 30th of a second, while the other was 1 over 250 seconds. Usually photographers use this uh, motion blur thing when they want to capture like the speed of things and the s stability of other things or the objects. For example, on that you see like cars going so fast and the red light just go like this as like they form lines. So it's really beautiful and sometimes they, you can make a good composition if you also have a tripod to capture like the somewhat stable and the other object is moving. So I was like, hmm, that's a great concept of a cover, I will say, a, not a cover, but an album in general. So I was like, hmm, what the track list will be? I remember in Instagram I asked people like, what blur, uh, when I say blur, what comes, what pops in your head? And some people mentioned uncertainty. I think about cloud, which, uh, which means uh, shame in Arabic, and deceivingness, fatigue, empty heaviness. That's very really contradictory. And yeah, and since it's not a lot of titles for a track list, it, I think it's gonna be an EP. So I decided, hmm, I'm gonna add four by me. So the title that I added is Meeting People is Easy. It's uh, an homage to a movie of Radiohead. They, there they did the tour of OK Computer in 1997. They were in a big state of burnout. I mean, the reception of the album was crazy. I mean, I think they got the first Grammy at that time. And it was like considered like the f final, I won't say final rock album, but the true rock music was like this is like the la big last event of rock music. And it captures like a lot of themes of technology, dependency on technology, the loss of uh, identity and like the, the routine like going to work, uh, probably not having the best social life whatsoever. I mean, even trying to build connection with people, it becomes easy with time. I mean, I will say that, but I will say it, I'm struggling to make connections with, with people. It's become harder and harder with time. And you can say I'm losing a lot in the process. And I added fizzle out because some relationships out of nowhere fizzle out. You, you don't notice like why you have until it's gone unfortunately. I mean I won't say it's because of work but I will say a lot of things could like affect this relationship and you out of nowhere notice that these people don't exist in your life anymore. Then I will add rain to sad 
I mean, let's be real, it's November in Algeria and it's like 3 degrees outside, I mean... We are in November! It's supposed to be dark academia, rain, I don't know, I'm still wearing like summer clothes. And we are in the 50th of November today, by the way, <laughs> just to let you know how badly it is right now, weather-wise. So, yeah, I'm not enjoying the sun anymore, I'm kind of tired of it. I mean, I'm done. When it's gonna rain, though? It's really... It's it's uh, consuming the life out of me now. Also, the wrinkles can also be like the miracle of trying to hide your tears while looking in the window or you are actually in the outside while it's raining and you're embracing the rain to hide your tears because then you are in a bad situation whatsoever. I kind of feel that, but I don't also think that it happened to me before. And for the sake of this video, I'm gonna put Focus probably as the last uh, track of the album because at this point I was like trying to be on Focus, but the lens is like playing games with me and I'm tired of it. When you do the motion blur, you don't necessarily like capture everything uh, precisely and correctly. I mean, sometimes when you try to capture someone who's standing and doing no movement whatsoever, sometimes they come out of focus. So you need like support, like a tripod for example, to uh, get the picture correctly. So yeah, uh, the track list so far is messy, so here's the final track list. And I'm gonna try to do like the cover art for each uh, track and also the cover of the album. Like, uh, music wise, I'm gonna say it's a mix of rock and trip hop music. I mean, trip hop is a very cool genre, especially when it's raining. I enjoy it a lot actually when it's raining. I listen a lot to Boris Head, Tricky, and Massive Attack, and sometimes good lo fi music. Uh, for example, some old Joji music before it was, he was signed to 88 Ryzen. And there's a art, good artist by the name of Lotus Flower, Jada. I mean, it's not like a real lo fi, but it's very hip hop uh, based music with a lot of uh, samples in it and that I really enjoy. A lot of samples comes from jazz music, which is also a good uh, genre that I recommend people to listen to. And for the rock music, I would say Radiohead. I mean, let's be real, you can't go wrong with Radiohead. I mean, each album is different. The music sphere is different. So, yeah. I gotta try to capture on this video some photos and yeah, I hope you enjoyed this concept. I know I'm trying to do some crazy things on YouTube, but I have my hand on the dictionary. So yeah, I hope you guys will enjoy the process, even though I don't think you will enjoy it, but yeah, see you around. <laughs> This is the amount of dark night photography that I've done in my entire life and people reaction about me having a camera outside was like a mixed bag. I couldn't like seriously like talk while I was out. I just gonna put it here. Hello, now I'm in the building, feeling a bit safe. Man, I felt really weird having like a camera outside. People had like mixed bag reactions. Some people were okay with me, some were joking nicely with me, and some people were really rude to the point I was like, 
Why did I forgot my AirPods? Not AirPods, I mean Lenovo pods. Anyway, I didn't like shoot all the necessary cover for the track list, but I will try in the daylight, so yeah. outside and yes it's raining not necessarily too much rain but it's I think the most perfect rain possible yes it kind of stopped it wasn't raining that much and I'm trying to find some uh, angles places something Related to the pictures. I mean not necessarily to the pictures but the track. Yeah okay. It's cool though to walk in the city while it's raining. Not necessarily raining, but you get the point. Ooh. That was a good sign over there. can tell but I'm being held up protected with my camera I'm trying not to hide it like this like a criminal uh, it's not like I saw something I'm just really being protected with my camera because um, the type that I have the M50 shouldn't be like damaged with the water or ice it's damaged so good so yeah shout out to my friend Alhansa on, on your street by the way <laughs> I'm not seeing myself though yay so here we go God has blessed us with the rain, finally. It, you cannot see it from the screen, but it's actually extremely dark. I just like popped out the color, so it looks like pretty good. I'm gonna try to capture like the water in the, in the ground, try to do something with it and make the last picture finally it's like 10 out of 10 i forgot the numbers of the track so yeah i'm happy to put this thing it's pretty hideous but we still love it i mean oh it's cold yay i'm gonna find now a place to do so Thank you. 